Plenty of people have called it quits and moved on from the ski and snowboard season in the past few weeks. But the greatest snow on earth has just kept falling this spring as late as this morning. Yeah, it really has, hasn't it? As new special Jed Bull shows us, a couple of Utah resorts are offering unique deals this weekend to help lure people back. If you just haven't taken enough turns on the mountain this season, there's still time because there's still plenty of snow. Brighton and Snowbird are the only two Utah resorts still open, but they each received more than a half foot of snow overnight, and riders are raving about the conditions. Fresh powder in late April. Conditions today are amazing. This is perfect. On top of bases that are still about 10 feet deep, Sam Huff moved here a year ago after eight winters in Colorado. I've never had a powder day this late in the year before, and it's my birthday today too, so it's a good way to celebrate it. And he plans to get back out again. Through May, so I try to ski whenever I can. Saturday at Snowbird, they're celebrating the longest snow riding season in Utah. Bring a full season pass from any Utah resort to the ticket window, ride free for the day. All of the terrain is open here at the mountain, and uh, it just it feels more like mid-March than it does almost the end of April. At Brighton, they're celebrating the 80th year of operations. Bring a season pass from any resort in America and buy a $40 lift ticket Saturday or Sunday, which is Brighton's last day. We've been kind of mild temps, so we're not seeing a very quick melt off of snow either. In the high basins, hydrologists tell me the snow is now melting about a quarter inch a day. In three weeks, it will pick up to an inch and a half a day. That's how fast the snow is already melting at mid elevation. But on the surface, you can have snow, you can have slush and corn, um, you know, but it's all about the pilot. And the pilot is having an excellent ride. It's winter here right now, and um, we're all loving it with smiles on our faces. And here's something to consider if you are coming up the mountain this weekend. UTA has stopped the ski bus service for the season, so plan on carpooling to cut down on emissions and also cut down on the crowd in the parking lot. At Snowbird, Jed Bowl for KSL 5 News. He's right.